Alrighty then. Back to it. Ooh, commander required. And we have a good selection of commanders. Including ourselves. Oh! We're facing this guy again. Who has... Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not dying in battle to lose the Grand Republic. Uh, that's not happening. Thank you. No, no, thank you. I appreciate the thought. No, no. Mm -mm. The fool's errand. But I don't exactly know why it's going to take so long to get the appropriate war score here. Because we've beaten him at every turn, but we just can't get any large amount of war score, it looks like. Always trifles. You could move your troops on the ship. I wouldn't get to them. Don't. I want all the battles. Our court physician is now renowned. Always good. You would like to marry have her oh no i'm not paying that not to make our court physician happy sorry oh look at that another little daughter more swedish troops for the slaughter and this time they got away, just in time. Only to reappear, five millimeters next to me. Are these... Are these mercenaries? Might just be. Oh, there's 100% for us. <laughs> well, I did want to see the realm prosper before, but all these opportunities just kind of present themselves. Oh, our courtier, the blessed, has passed. Right, Georg. You've done well. Haven't you? Ooh, ooh, a quick one. We could make him into anything we want. Let's go with stewardship. Because there's a chance to become shrewd from this one. Thrift is always right. I don't want, I don't know why you would want conscientious. Bit weird. Could also declare war against Norway. Could claim Norway for one of our chiefs. But that wouldn't work because we are not an empire. But we could claim Romstal. Which is up there. You have no troops whatsoever. Can we do war for you? With you? Against you? Right, get that. How far are you in your war? 21% in your favor. I am thinking. Why not aggressively expand in the north while we still can? I have a minimum of 20 cities in your realm. I have a fully upgraded family palace. I mean, we're, we're kind of getting toward Aegis Island. Our family's palace is in the later stages of being upgraded. And we do need more cities in our realm. So this thing doesn't have a city. Does this thing have a city? Yeah, this thing has a city. 
That's not what we would fight about, Romstar. As a city though. Okay, let's do that. We will want a Romstar from the Norwegians. And we will want Österladen. Österdalen from the Norwegian Revolt. How about that? Raise our own private little army. Split them in half. We send one there. And one there. And then we'll see how it works out. We will lead this one. And we'll get the weaker commanders on our side. Let Dusley. This is not really balanced, is it? Right, let us march towards Norway. We would claim a little bit of here, but it is cut off by these high cliffs, which we will not be able to scale. The theocracy in the middle of everything. We have won some victory, to no one's great surprise. Uh, bottom Siege Master here. Are there armies? You. Not leading your troops. On here. What do you all want? Half sister. Denmark can have my half sister. The others can go away. Right, let's go get them. They must be here somewhere. I will want to lead here. Let's put Siege Master in place. probably up there. We'll get them. Before they win. Hopefully. Let's split these. We don't need so many for this one siege. Maybe we can arrive in time to help our troops out here. No, nope. they will be beaten before we arrive. That's a shame. But now we can mop up. Sorry guys, I miscalculated. They're running all the way home. And they will likely hit this barrier down here. Oh no, they, they they are in a shattered retreat. They will run past it. I thought I gave you a siege commander. And I thought I gave you a siege commander too. Come on now. Don't be fools.
Where are the Norwegians? Probably some sieging going on somewhere here. By which we can tell where they are. Are they this? Probably. Oh, let's just go here with them. Down. And also these, because I constantly forget about them. Go take care of these guys. Let's go with a commander that's not going to die in two seconds. And that looks to have been the Norwegian army. Catch you. You don't get away. That might be the 5% we're looking for here. If not, this battle will be. Go. How about we have some peace here, huh? Sounds great, doesn't it? I figured you would like that. Right then, let's catch his army. Let our retinue off and stand down the other group for this anymore. Save a little bit of money in the process. Let's get them. Have my court here. If I'm not betting them, I don't care who does. Ooh, oh, hello. Mmm, Winter Soldier. Ooh, that would be good. Very useful up here. Mountain Expert, you would think. But Winter Soldier, I think this is the only region in the world where Winter Soldier actually makes sense. So we'll go with that. Because there's a lot of winter out here, and winter is horrific. Winter combat plus 50%, I mean just... Just think of the gains. Come on, Norway. Give in. You know you want to. Just slowly eating up. Scandinavia. How strong are you? Strong enough to have an alliance with. Of course I didn't check if they're in any battles right now, but it doesn't matter. Are these counting in battles? No, they're not. We have not had a battle with them yet. Because I have zero idea where they are. Where are your troops? Up here. Oh no. You're fighting the Norwegian revolt up there. Guess what, retinue? Get a new job. Ain't that amazing. Off to Iceland. Let's kill some Norwegians. 
This is, of course, I mean, it, it always feels a little bit like cheating that you can just click on where they're leading troops right now and then you can kind of see where they are at. But look at Sweden being eaten alive. This is a pretty much insane. Everyone doing good? You should get a good educator. Who's the best educator for this? Margaret. Ugh, not the Danish holy war again. Why do you rope me into these? Rather, why do I let myself get roped into these? So they're right there. See the little siege going on. They have 12 troops. Is that... Then the truth of it. What are we having here? Arctic. How many troops do you have, Norway? Yes. Oh no, that's us. <laughs> How does he have 19,000 troops? Where are your men? I am utterly and completely astonished by this. I don't know where the Norwegians are. <gasps> there! There's a bunch of them. Get them! Go get them! I think by killing the 12 that we killed, we freed them up to recruit new troops. I want my retinue back home. Our brother was killed. That is unacceptable. Very unacceptable. Designated heir. Who is next best in line? Half done. Though this club footed soldier is younger. And he reminds me of ourselves. All up for now. Will be High Admiral. Inquisitor. Oh no, we can't. Right. It has to be. It has to be directly related. Otherwise, it does not work. So, Half Done will be our designated heir and our designated regent. And our High Admiral. Okay. Let's get our retinue. Did we not just kill all the Norwegian troops? Does that not count? Plus 0.6% for one battle. Dude, I really want to send you troops, but I'm a little preoccupied here. Let's kill these. They're not going to count, but we'll kill them anyway. Norway, Norway, where are your soldiers, Norway? Denmark, Denmark, why do you throw your men away? The 
should probably stand down our troops before we get involved in this. Let's get the Teutonics involved as well, when we're already at war with them. Maybe that works. There! Norwegians! I feel so bad. I really like Norwegians. As a matter of fact, I love them to a degree. Some, at least. But very much so. We will scarcely find someone who loves Norwegians as much as I. Some. This should give us something with the Teutonics involved as well. So we can just link up with them and form our own Christian death blob against the heathens. Touch, and I wish to lead here. I want all the best commanders on this. And our 800 Norwegian hunters will keep hunting Norwegians. And we will also keep upgrading our palace because I always forget about this. Upgrade the shipyard. How much attrition do we have here? Oh, space. Okay. Ah, finally. That wasn't so difficult, was it? How's our earning? Still earning. Like to reinforce the Danish here. As we settle down for the night in Deltuva, a comet passes overhead. The soldiers start talking excitedly what it might mean. God guides our hand in this just war. Prince Mayor Georg the Monk gains the trait as zealous. Morale of armies plus 10%. Hello. For how long? Two years. Taskmaster, two years plus marshal. Well, let's be zealous. Plus two marshal. That's good. Help our Danish brothers. Let's hope uh, we are being helped here. So I always forget about these troops and I forgot about these as well. Come on. Stop it. Stop it, brain. Touch again. The death blob stays undisturbed. Oh look at look at my troops here. No support, I mean there is some support that came in later, but up until then stood their grounds all by their self some lonesome. Let's link up with another army of ours. from supply limit okay I think we'll hop out here do our own thing link with our own troops as I walk through the seat of Jessica I suddenly feel someone bump into me Archet looks surprisingly like mine in the his hands let us find that kid and make him pay we would lose kind Maybe he could be of use. Probably a decent spy master, no? For a good steward. 
Aldo the Butcher. We've lost a commander in battle. Oh, we have killed a commander in battle. So the Teutonic Order is still next to us, which is important to me. Because I don't want to be alone when the enemy comes. I don't even know if they have enough troops to defend against this this time. This time we actually have an army. Not just the Danish getting battered. Has been quite some time since I regularly went out hunting or trained for combat. Well, we will put ourselves to work. But we do gain the trade fat right now. This guy has done nothing but lead wars and armies. How does one get fat from that? Oh, look at that. There's a death blob. Let's combine our death blob and move up here because they are definitely going for the Danish. And the Teutonic Order is too lethargic to notice. Oh. They're coming for us. Uh, Teutonic Order? Right, let's check. Is it winter? It is winter. We get a 50% combat bonus. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Get a better flanker here. Our unyielding comrade is in position. We need a court tutor. Our dear wife will court tutor. And we can use another commander here. Let's assign commanders on the lower rung as well. Here, you help here. You help here. You help here. And you help here. Okay. So our 10,000 against their... 15,000. We could bring in our retinue too. As a reinforcement. So let us. Because I don't think the Danish or the Teutonic Order are going to come for us. But let's watch first how our plus 50% combat bonus in winter works for us. Not well. Not well at all. We're, we're losing quickly. And the Teutonic Order is just Moving away further and further into the sunset. Both centers have been broken. But we have brought in reinforcements, putting us back on the map. And thus we have a chance at least again. With our retinue involved, we have won. Without our retinue, we would have been lost. Curse our allies. The Teutonic Order won. Let's group them. Split off the retinue. I'm sorry, the retinue. And we get 800 and something gold and another artifact, a saintly skull. Need to follow those. Can't let them regroup. Catching some appears. Come on, kill them 
before they can reinforce. Oh, this was basically a meat grinder. And we've taken a bunch of prisoners. Let us go here now. Where is this peasant revolt you speak of? Up there in the north. Luckily, we had prepared our troops to move anyway. And look at all the money we got. Look at all that gold waiting to be spent on good, good stuff. So on good, good stuff, we will spend it. Maybe also spare a coin for our cities. Let's spare some coin for our cities at home. This is very expensive for what it gives us, so we're not going to do it. This is much more sensible for what it costs. Two higher tier keeps, and what can we do here? Right, I wanted to build university, let's build it. I did want that for a while now. And we are earning handsomely currently. Having a 30 commander is already cool, but having your own ruler be the level 30 commander is quite another thing. That's just double cool. What's the trade post here? I don't know why it pleases me that that girl became something. This dude has to die. Ooh, new technology, where? Warfare, so... More ret... We don't really need more ret news, honestly. More morale would be cool, but... Let's check our unit composition, what do we have? Light infantry, heavy infantry, light cavalry, heavy cavalry. So light and heavy cavalry... Hmm. I think infantry still is where it is for us. I mean, attack is pretty strong, but morale... Again, morale is king. But cavalry would also be pretty cool. Let's go with infantry. Right, Siege Master to the front, please. I will sit on the side here. Enjoy the show. Oh no, actually, we have another battle to fight. Up here. Look at those rebels. Um, scum of the earth. Get in some soldiers on the side. My steward passed. Okay, let's get a good outsider. We haven't had a good steward in a while. And I feel like we're missing out on gold here. A genius steward. Who has depression. Let's get a younger steward who's not as much of a genius but lives longer. Potentially, anyway. You never really know with these people. What are you good at? So, Marshall. So, Marshall, you will become son to our brother back taxes I don't think there is much left in terms of the great Lithuanian army but we will have to do some sieging the holy order got more
them. Send these troops back home. And then go back. Lead armies where it matters. Look at that. He's reconvened his armies. Consolidating his forces. During the battle, we fearlessly charged ahead on horseback directly into the enemy ranks. Members of our personal guards riding beside us tumbled off their horses as enemy arrows found their marks. But I charged, plowed straight into the enemy skirmishes and sword ran red with their blood. All good. All I want out of life. What vassal levies? Probably some ships. And them down. Okay, this will be a difficult battle again. Definitely not in our favor. In a straight crossing. But it is still winter, so we should be in the advantage strongly. And thus we have taken what little remains of their army for now anyway siege master back in the siege seat please we are going to sit on the sideline and watch your genius work and now these ships of our vassal friend so he doesn't get too upset And we could also stand on our own ships for now. Just save a little money. Trade rod running, thank you for asking. We'll teach him to be a winter soldier. And thus, the Holy War is ended. And we can start to move to where we can stand on our troops comfortably. So Denmark took a piece out of this. Ouch. I've recently inherited a bejeweled dagger from Anna. How good is that thing? Oh, look at that saintly skull. Swedish greatsword. A jeweled dagger. Can't even use it. This thing can go. Wait, what is this? Andvaranaut. National tax modifier plus 20%. Are you kidding me? But health minus one. Okay. So this is a dangerous thing to have and hold and use. That's a, that's a clear... I mean, if you're strong or brawny, you might want to do it. Oh, no, I can't wear it. Why? Follows the Germanic religion, which we don't. But well, that's cool. That's a cool artifact. That one. So, what I figure with the Teutonic Order. Is that we can declare a holy war in Estonia and then just tell the Teutonic Order. Hey, you know these Estonian infidels? You remember those? How about you help destroy them? Oh, I see that working out. People need focuses. Focus on this, please. Tonic order would come against Estonia. 
Where is the capital of Estonia anyway? Could we do? A bull bunch of smaller. Blue off on Novograd. Ruthenia is just this piece. Oof. Gala. Steps. Probably Novograd would be the best thing here. Nearby Romuva. Oh, you're pretty alone with that. Oh, you got these guys over there. They are a little bit beaten, aren't they? Yeah. White. You're not the not a spring chicken either. Especially if we get the Teutonics in on this. Well, considerations for another time. Thanks for watching and see you around. Bye-bye.